being a discovery for your values. We all have a different set of values and it's important that we identify which one are the most important to us. Maybe it's family, maybe it's integrity, maybe it's trust, maybe it's respect. But it is important that you like identify which one that is. Because this is your journey. This is where you're going. This is who you want to become. You want to become those values. And if you don't understand the state of being of those values and the discovery that you need to have to become this person, well, then you're not going in the right direction, are you? There is um, this young woman that she's amazing. She is so much giving. She takes care of single moms um, because there's a need in our city to do that. She collects furniture and donations to help single moms get by during the difficult times because she was one of them. She was abandoned by her mom. She's very kind and very caring. And she, one of her most important value yeah, is to the moms so they can be respected, so they be honored in their distress, in their desired. So I asked her, did you forgive your mom for abandoning you, for putting you up for adoption? And she said, I tried, but it didn't work. She would have nothing of me. And I said to her, well, maybe you haven't forgiven her then. And it's important that you do. It's important that you see her as you see all the other moms, as struggling, as doing the best that she could with what she had. And if you can see her with those eyes, if you can see her with love and compassion, you will become this woman that you want to be. You will become this, this mom that you want to be. Otherwise, the risk is you will carry that inside of you and be on the lookout and discovery for people that mistreat other people and abandon other people. Instead of being a discovery for moms that are awesome, for moms that are trying their best and you can be there for them. What are your values? Spend some time today to reflect on the most important values in your life where they are and how meaningful they are to you. Identify three at most. One, if you can. Start with narrowing down. Identify 16 and then go to eight and then go to four and then go to three and finally go to one. And then be in the practice of discovering this value in other people, in life.